This video is a demo to generate a delay of one second using Cystic Timer. This method uses an interrupt-based approach. In this tutorial, we generate a one second delay. With a Cystic Timer interrupt of TM4C123 microcontroller. We will toggle an LED with a delay of one second. Using the interrupt service routine of Cystic Timer handler function. In the last tutorial, we have seen an example to generate one second delay, but we used a polling method. In this tutorial, we will see an example of an interrupt method. Interrupt enable bit of Cystic Timer control register enables or disables the interrupt functionality of Cystic Timer. If we set the interrupt enable bit to 1, it enables the Cystic interrupt. That means, whenever the counter reaches zero from a reload value, the Cystic Timer requests the interrupt signal to the nested interrupt vector controller. As I said earlier, this video is just a demo. And the link of complete in-depth article is given in the description of this video. Now let's see the example code demo. This example code generates a delay of one second. Using an interrupt of Cystic Timer. And to demonstrate this. We will turn on and turn off on board green LED. Which is connected with PF3 pin of the Tiva launchpad. This code uses a interrupt method instead of polling method to toggle LED after one second. As you can see inside the while loop. We are doing nothing. Instead we have written a logic to turn on LED inside the cystic handler function. The name of the cystic interrupt service routine. As defined inside the startup file of TM4C123G microcontroller. In Kyle compiler is SysTick handler. This interrupt service routine is defined with weak attribute. That means we can redefine SysTick handler inside our main code. But the name of a specific ISR routine should remain the same. Hence, here we define the SysTick handler function with same name. And inside the handler we are toggling an LED. This handler function executes whenever cystic time interrupt occurs. Now upload this code to Tiva Launchpad. After that click on reset button of Tiva Launchpad. As you can see green LED is blinking with the rate of 1 second. For complete article and to download code check the link given in the description of this video. Thanks for watching. See you with next video.